Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome back to Vintage Comic Vault. Venom 2 image reveals Woody Harrelson's Cletus Cassidy with less crazy red hair. So Venom 2 star Tom Hardy revealed Woody Harrelson's new look as the serial killer Cletus Cassidy in an image from the sequel Venom 2. Tom Hardy has unveiled a Venom 2 image teasing Woody Harrelson's new hairdo as Cletus Cassidy in the sequel. After trying and failing to launch its own Marvel movie universe with 2014's The Amazing Spider-Man 2, Sony made a second attempt four years later with Venom. In addition to introducing Hardy as journalist Eddie Brock, the film ended with a mid credit scene featuring Harrelson as a serial killer, Cassidy. He even alluded to his eventual transformation into the symbiote supervillain Carnage should a second film come to pass. 856 million at the box office later and Venom 2 is now in pre-production with Harrelson reprising his role as Cassidy opposite Hardy and Nomi Harris as Cassidy's love interest Shriek. The sequel is about eight weeks into shooting right now and expected to hit theaters in October which means it could be starting its marketing in the foreseeable future ahead of then Hardy has provided a small glimpse of Cassidy in the sequel. The actor took to his Instagram account to post a photo of Harrelson as Cassidy in Venom 2 this morning along with a simple caption, Hello Cletus, take a look at the photos provided. And these are the first images we're getting Harrelson as Carnage. In the end of Venom, we saw Cassidy was in prison during Venom's credit scene, so it's not surprising to see he cleans up a bit after breaking out in the sequel. It looks like Harrelson will have slightly less ridiculous hair, which may come as a disappointing news to those who loved his red wig from the first movie. Of course, fans are far more excited to see him transformed into Carnage, but there's no need to rush the reveal. The first Venom was criticized for having devious CGI so that it's all the more reason to hold off on unveiling the Carnage costume until it's finalized. That goes double for the first look at Shriek, a.k.a. Francis Louise Barrison, who's expected to have her comic book superpowers in the sequel, like the ability to manipulate sound and fly. With Cassidy and possibly Shriek serving as its primary threats, Venom 2 is expected to delve deeper into the horror territory than we first than in the first movie. Even so, it should be in safe hands with Andy Serick's directing given his previous work on bleaker effects driven projects like Netflix Mowgli. In doing so, it may allow Sony's Marvel Cinematic Universe to further distinguish itself as a darker extension of the MCU brand. Following the release of Morbius, the living vampire spinoff this summer, it's a good thing the studio was taking steps to differ uh, differentiate the franchise too, considering they intend to release as many as five Spider-Man films between now and 2022, and that includes Venom 2. Also released today was a new set video from Venom 2 that has Woody Harrelson as Cletus Cassidy transforming into the symbiote supervillain Carnage. So as you could see, also included is the Instagram video that was leaked. So let me know what you think. Are you excited for Venom 2 and the introduction of Carnage and how that might affect the Spider-Man movies? And, believe it or not, Morbius to come into the Spider-Man universe. And how does that also affect the MCU? Will Sony and the MCU have a better understanding of what these movies can do? We shall see. All right, guys. Thanks a lot. Like, subscribe, and hit that bell when you hear new videos. Okay. Take care and have a great night.